Hello and welcome to the Kilobits. My name is Francesca and I am joined by... I'm Aaron, the resident playtester of games that I'm no good at. And today we are playing the demo of Lightfall, which is a puzzle platformer that is being uh, kickstarted at the moment by Bishop Games. It runs out on the 6th of June. Um, so you're playing and I'm yep, judging I'm you. I'm currently tapping the controller trying to work out what I can do. I can move left and right and I can jump. Yep, and if you press left bumper and right bumper, the speed run options come up. Um, you have to press them simultaneously. Bumper. Bumper. I am pressing. Oh, there, there we go. you go. Ah. So it's it's kind of cool. It's got like inbuilt speed running stuff. You're going to play. Okay. I, I, I'm not entirely sure what a I'm meant to be doing. Build. I didn't either. Um, but this is, this is kind is of... Is this going to be like a run right and jump at the right time kind of game? Probably. I, it it as feels you can very see, speed runny. I'm not great at jumping at the right time. Uh, but, um, let's try it. It kind of, for me, it comes across a bit like Limbo, if you see the art style, um, with the, you know, the silhouettes oh. and the big glowing eyes. That's weird. Um, Storyline-wise, we don't have much. There is a, a world called, like, Numbra? Numbra, yeah. And Almost like Penumbra, mm -hmm. which is the fuzzy bit on the outside of a shadow. And we have this guy called Strix, who is uh, narrating our little... He doesn't even look like a child. He looks like a, a fairy. No, this looks like, uh, what's the game, that Flash game with that guy with his pants? Flash game with the guy with the pants. Yeah, there's like that little like blonde kid, I think, with like a kind of Goku-ish hair, who runs around like pants adventure. I can't remember. Okay. It's a great game. It's very much like this, in terms of playability. Oh, you're well, really bad. I am. Um, I should hide the speedrun thing because then we can't tell how many times I've died. That's that's quite sneaky. But to me, it feels like a bit like Limbo. You've got the glowing oh. eyes. You've got the uh, silhouette outlines of the levels, um, although with a bit more color. And you'll you'll notice mechanically the ah, fact that you can, you can hold on stick to, to walls and stuff. Um, makes me feel a little bit oh, like uh, I'm... Super Meat Boy esque. Just take your time. Okay. I, I feel like there's like thought that's required here, and not. Do <laughs> <laughs> you want me to do it? No, I've I've heard that we cut the flailing out though. Nope. People can see you dying. Time. That was a bit weird. You you clipped I the stuck corner and, and stuck and then okay. fell to your death. Right. Let's try it. Let's try a different ones. Let's try a little jump. So it's getting from here to here because they're both. I suppose you just so have to why do don't you the just top. wait till you're at yeah. the top? Yeah. I'm impatient. Can you not tell? I think, I mean, in fairness, I don't think you'd be a very good speedrunner, um, yeah. considering how many times you've died, and there's, there's probably a really efficient for... way you can go through this obstacle, where you, like, Most jump from deaths. platform to the platform without having to go all the way around. Um, but that's why, I mean, I think it'll be quite popular for the speedrunning community. I'm energetic. Yeah, how annoying. And these are little checkpoints, so, you know, if you die now, you'll be fine. Hey, that's not crystals. Him. You probably want to walk into those. Nope. And you meant to collect them. I'm not falling Pretty for sure that. you meant to collect them. Where, in, a, in a world where everything is When he says is like, cautious, he means greedy. Hold right trigger. I think it's sprint. Hey, ah, you're good. Okay. Well, surely on a speedrunning game, you just always hold right trigger. Yeah, I'd assume so. You'll probably die if you do that, though. What is this thing? It's a... A box. Boy present box. Could it be I like his name is, is Strix. I feel like fantasy names, oh. it's cool not to use vowels. Oh. That makes things... Can you surely you can just... Oh, you can do it at this point. I was going to say, I thought you could just like spam the level just going la 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 la, but that's not possible. <laughs> That would be a fun game. Oh, look, there's a little oh, constellation oh. showing you what to do. Oh. That's really neat. That is kind of cool. Did you see that, like, like reminding somehow you. saving it? Wait, no, I have it at this point. Surely I can just... Oh, Yeah, but it's not can't. very quick, is no, it? No, there's a limit on how far you can have it. Okay, that makes sense. Oh, really? So how... Yeah. What do you mean by how far? So, like, there's only certain areas, I think. Like, you need it for this bit, so you can do it here. But, like, it doesn't think you need it. Oh, maybe it does. I think, I think at some point it runs out. you probably can do it constantly. But I think the whole point is to be quick rather than to, you know, like, make it easy. I don't yeah. know. Did I take full damage? Hey. I See, I told damage. you the crystals were your friends. Yeah. Um, but uh, I guess this goes to disprove crystal healing, right? Exactly. <laughs> no, it's not. It's, uh, if we're talking homeopathy, we need to, like, dilute them a million times and then they'll the, be more The effective. crystals? Yeah. Ah, oh, people who think that crystals have healing powers are... Probably not interested in gaming run-throughs. But maybe. It's okay, I don't think we're gonna offend anyone here. Hopefully uh, not. So I have to make a bridge. Oh, I see. Yeah, you gotta make a little box. Yeah, see? So how are you finding the game? Oh, there's water! There's like water falling to power the, the wagon wheels. Nice particle effects. Yeah, I like it. So how are you finding it? Um, I think I'll get better as I get the hangar up. I don't know what this darkness stuff is. Nah, I think you're okay. Checkpoint. Don't- Oh, that was- that was close! I feel like the, that was one of the speedrunning elements where you've gotta quickly change direction. Um, and it'll be something like familiarity with the levels and people get faster. Do you want to show people how many times you've died? Only eight. That's not that That's bad. That's not that bad. Yeah. Well, so I think the problem with all speedrun games like this is they all have... Eight, nine. 
That was <laughs> that was very sneaky. So the problem with speedrunning games like this, I think I'm also awful when I'm talking at the same time, but like they all have slightly different uh, feel, and it takes time to actually get into the game because otherwise you'll just like you'll jump too high. Yeah, I know. I mean, they, come on, they're sticking out of the ground. It's kind of telling you when to jump. But no, I agree. I think you get into a rhythm, and a lot of it becomes muscle memory. And I'm pretty sure the people who do the um, world records for speedruns and stuff, a lot of it's just playing Not the me. game so much that you're uh, you're completely familiar with it. Because um, you know, familiar, duh. familiar, uh, uh, familiarity. Yeah, whatever that word is, it makes you better. I don't think you actually need your box here. You realize that? It's fun. <laughs> that it's that one. I'm cursed. Okay, let's let's be a little bit sneaky. Sneaky. Well, I know which one it is, so I can just be like. You could just uh -huh. like, take it a little oh, wait, slower. It's, not, this one it's anyway. not even that one. No, it's, it's like not. not that one. It's that one. That one. Yeah, that ah. sneaky second one. Oh, <laughs> god damn it! You hit the ceiling, which is, by the way, slowly coming down. So I feel like you're probably meant to be quick here. Yeah. Could you not just tap and do little jumps? Yeah, like that, rather than even no, using the box. Definitely can't do that. It's definitely not a strategy that works. I like how as soon as I give you a simple suggestion, suddenly it's like I'm a simple I being. did it. Well done. I'm proud of you. Hey, cutscene. Um. You got bonked on the head by a crystal. And I'm falling. You're falling. It's kind of like those signs of it. It's like, <gasps> beware of the edge. There's an evil owl. How do you know he's evil? Well, he looks evil. It looks like he's going to eat you and feed you to his kin. Yeah, but owls just kind of look creepy. Owls are great. Those, like, Everyone is fond of owls. Mandibles. Except for maybe mice, you know, shrews. Simon Cowell. Voldemort. What? Because Hedwig dies, right? I oh, was spoiler alert. <laughs> I was making a Weeble reference. I don't think Voldemort is scared of owls. No, he just doesn't like them. So it turns out that male. this Strix fellow is in fact that owl. Um, and the Kamloops apparently used to live here. And I think you are in fact a, one of the Kamloops, but apparently our villages have been desecrated. That sounds why? like that's what from a game, do? isn't it? Our, oh no, our sacred grove is being de desecrated. Is from uh, Warcraft 3. Okay, so I can throw it. I think you can position it with the stick. Oh, so I can break a beam. And it's almost as if that triangle and that triangle are the same. Hey, you did it. I'm so proud of you. I reckon you can climb this. I mean, I bet you could be I feel lazy like that's and just take. Kill me. No, so that's you can not just. Like that you can jump off these platform edges, though, right? Yeah, but it's going up, so I, I want to think, presumably, it's taking me somewhere important. You are like the worst speedrunner ever. Why? Like, oh, come on, these platforms are totally so you can tan it up. Now you need to take the. <gasps> oh, you're gonna die. Oh, I see what you mean. I can be, like, bouncing. Yeah. You can just turn it up the edges. I mean, you can wall jump. Hmm. I am a bad speedrunner. You know what they say? It's the hair and the tortoise. And I am neither. I'm like the recklessness of the hair with the speed of the top. Hey. Oh. <gasps> Seriously? That's... Ah. I feel like this, um, <laughs> this box mechanic is kind of yeah. cheap. So That's what I was thinking you could just do earlier. What? I don't understand. We're learning about the five divinities of oh, worship. Should I be doing this? Yeah, just keep going. It'll be fine. Hey, wait, 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 wait. Stop. In the background, there's... Okay, the Lux Luxana, the goddess of light, also has light up... She like, has a diamond boobs. Breast. Yeah, she has, like, a diamond boob. Flashy folks. She can't... He, I don't he's, really can't know what else to say about that, folks. That's kind of weird, because she's not particularly, Why? like... Oh, I should break the beam. ...boobacious, but for some reason she has a light up chest. But this is Luxana, apparently. We're learning gem. about the lore of the Kamloops. The narration actually is quite good, and the music... Um, How do I leave ...really kind of atmospheric. I think you just let go of Y. I was at no, you have to press oh. again. It's a toggle. Okay. Don't hit the crystals, they're not your friends. You can do this, I believe in you. I'm smart. Slow and steady wins the race. Well, actually, speed running. Well, I'm the only participant. Wins the race. I think you can just jump over that. I could, I should have done Why are you doing that? Yeah. Why are you needing to block the beam to stop you from hitting, oh! hitting the Um, Because laser? it's funny. It makes good TV. Mm. Hey, it's her again. Well, we need to learn about the five, and currently we've learned about the one. I don't know if we'll actually end up learning about them all if you keep dying at this rate. Like, how many deaths do you have now? Too many. Uh, fifteen. Fifteen. Still not terrible. You're dying more than once a minute, currently. You have fifteen deaths in ten minutes. You're dying about every... Uh... Maths... Two se forty seconds? Every forty seconds. Yeah, that, that was maths. Trust me on this one. Don't, don't go and try and work it out and find out if I'm right or not. Just trust me. Luckily what? I was gonna say luckily it's a pass on process, so it, there's no like expected. It's just a rate. Okay, Never mind. You're just talking nerd stuff, aren't you? Um I don't yes. know what a isn't a poisson a fish. Well no, it's when there's like, a rate, like but it doesn't Philippe mean that Poisson. it happens every single time. That's and that's what Phil Fish's name actually is. He's Philippe Poisson. He is in fact. 
Philippe Poisson. Because he's from like French Canada. I just kind of, I kind of think that's kind of great. Why are you placing it? Why didn't you just jump and? Because oh god, evil birds! I live for. The evil birds go like. Eah! It's like a really awful noise. You can't hear it, but it's awful. Hmm. Oh my Hello, god, you're my, so slow. The most abused mechanic in the game. You realize you could probably just sprint run and do that in two jumps. Yeah, but I'm not a professional gamer. Neither am I. I guess, like, gaming you're, is sort of my profession. I was gonna say, you're closer to being a professional gamer than I Yeah, but professional implies, like, you know, competence. That is professional gameplay. Hey, we found Shen! Is the Wrath of the Elements. Any relation to Chen? He has, um, he has twin blades, apparently. Is he a panda? I, he probably also well, doesn't have, like, diamond nipples. No, there he is. Look, he's, like, got a thing. I think we there was an old dude that we missed. Oh, we weren't really paying much that attention. That sticks out far more than I was expecting. You really, you realize you just have to, like, sit in the middle and just spam jump. Mm -hmm. Like, jump blocks. Like, you could just climb up. Come on. You don't even need those. I'm trying. Things. And uh, then... Nope, nope, nope. Jump into the middle. And then just... There you go. It's not about spamming it. You have you to reach up there. Oh, maybe you can only spam so many. Like, you're not getting another one. So you're going to have to fall down and land on an edge, I think. No, not on the edge of the box. There you go. So I think you have... Hmm. So... Oh, in a row, you can only do... Yeah, 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 I think you can only do so many in a row, is the point. Okay. Um... Until you touch a touch a platform, so it, it does actually have kind it's of some kind of facets on it. the entire game by walking on boxes in the air. Come on, there's definitely hey, a reason you go up here. You missed the lady. Look, she's got like horns. She doesn't have diamond boobs. Well, you can't tell. Maybe she does. It's the See, same they've shape. got like um, they're, they're representing all kinds kinds of women in this game. You've got diamond boob women, regular all, all boob women. Of women. I don't think you're meant to go this way. Why else would that? Okay, yeah, you're I think probably right. I it's, just saw a challenge and I wanted it's probably to... to. I think it's probably to force you to actually face the evil birds. <laughs> oh, oh, Almost. that was close. Don't let them bully you around. I've gone back boy. into uh, hold right trigger, sprint, tap buttons, hope. Oop, birds. Okay, be careful. Be careful. Ah, this is better. Get all that scary. They're a bit. Ugh, they're kind of. I, I don't know. He said. You were saying? You're not that scary. I Get wasn't stabbed. terrified, I was just deadified. They like 180 no scope you. One shot, one kill. I'm pretty sure if you use the AWP and shoot someone in the foot, it still kills them. The AWP is one shot wherever you hit them, right? Uh, Which no, one I think it's 90 now? damage. 90 damage in the foot. Uh, maybe it's. I think it actually might, it might be a kill if they don't have uh, body armor. If you have body armor, how does that protect your feet? Because body armor protects the entire body. It's Counter Strike hitboxes, they make no sense. Hey, he called you a chump. Hey, we Ooh, need to see Nox. Go back and see Nox. I want to see Nox. Oh. Where? Is... Nox is a dude in this? Oh, I, I can't, can't even see. see him. In um, in mythology, Nox is like the goddess of night. I'm pretty sure in like Greek, no Greek, Roman, Roman it's Nox and Greek is Nyx. There you go. There's some fun god facts. Okay, we're gonna find we Animus. The, way around. the ancient of number. Yes, I'm pretty sure. Um, so now we have some storyline. We're gonna find Animus. He's a friend of the Kamloops. And, and I guess that's the end of the demo. We're not gonna find Animus. We're not gonna answer. find out today because the game's not out yet and that's all we have. Uh, so is this on their Kickstarter page? Yep, you can play the that. demo now on the Kickstarter page and you can also support the demo. So you I downloaded this from the Kickstarter or...? Yeah, yeah, there's a link and you can just straight up download it. And then you can play it with a controller or with the keyboard. We never want to see your final death count. It was probably like I'm million. sure people at home can work it out if they really want to. Um, but yeah, so they're trying to raise, what, 20,000 Canadian dollars. Uh, they've got 11 days to go as of filming, so they end on the 6th of June. Um, so if you're interested in this kind of style of game, I think I think it was pretty cute, pretty fun. Yeah, it's pretty polished. Like, I mean, we've only seen two mechanics so Yeah, far, I think it could do with it a little bit more in terms of mechanics, like, other than just the box and stuff. What are they hoping to continue with, with the funding? Is it for, like, are they doing more development? Have they got stretch goals? Or? Yeah, I think it's for further development. Um, it's already been seen greenlit, uh, but they do have, like I said, the Kickstarter. I don't know too much about it, but it's a cute little indie platformer, and this has been kind of fun. It was reasonably fun. Um, but yeah, That's so high this, praise from me, reasonably This fun. has been The Killer Bits, and uh, we've been playing Lightfall by Bishop Games. If you like this video, you can hit that thumbs up button. Yeah. And if you like me, you can hit the thumbs up button. Yeah. No. Um, and, you know, let us know in the comments below what you think of the game, if there's any other platformers you're interested in us playing, and how you feel about Kickstarter, because I'm not one for Kickstarter. I like I, I like to see games on Kickstarter, but I never fund anything. Whereas Peter from the Killer Bits, I think he's fund, funded like 80 different Kickstarters. He's like, I think he has more money than sense. But yeah. Also, we have a Facebook. Facebook.com slash The Killer Bits. Yep. And a Twitter. At The Killer Bits. I'm so proud of you. Yeah. Um, so we'll see you guys uh, with another video. Have a great day and thanks for watching.
Bye.